Hey, what is up YouTube? Today, I thought I wanted to give you my first Windows video on my other YouTube channel right here. And yeah, I thought I wanted to give you the video of my childhood computer that I've ever used since uh, before my computer swaps since 2018. So yeah, I thought I wanted to give you an overview of the startup and shutdown on my Windows Vista right here. As you can see, the old logo of Hewlett Packard, which is an HP Pavilion. Of course, Windows Vista. So yeah, we're gonna run this in a moment. So yeah, right here, this is the model I have since 2006 or seven. So here's the other side right here, which is there's the model number, A6030N which is that's the old PC that's been running very well including the one with the hard drive who used to worn out from the windows but now on it's been fixed every time so yeah as you can see I thought I wanted to give you the quickest or if I wanted to give you the uh, quick video of the this computer that I wanted to show you that I wanted to give the most popular viewers from this right here so here's my own speaker I use the one with my own speaker instead of a monitor speakers because the one it's kind of boring including the one with the screen is kind of wide so yeah it's working pretty good which is this is the HP VP 17 and here's the same matching as the uh, setup on this which is actually a mismatch around keyboard and the mouse, which is how I use it for my laptop every time. So yeah. Alright, here we go. But first off, I'm gonna turn the monitor on. You can see blue glowy right here. Making sure the cables hooked up pretty good, including the quarters in their way. So yeah. Hmm. Already uh, hooked it up already. HP. I mean, it's kind of a bit lazy. So, is it? I want to make sure if it is hooked on properly. So yeah, now it's working. It says monitor goes to sleep. So, all right. Here we go on a Windows Vista startup and shutdown in 2021. So yeah, here we go. Here's the uh, Microsoft Corporation. That means Windows is loading up and starting up. So as you can see, this is the those right here from the hard drive. Moving on, I'll give you the view after the startup sound. And here's the mouse cursor. And there it is. And yeah, don't worry about this password. My uh, parents are the administrator from this computer, which is, you know, sorry about if I can't come on to this, but maybe, maybe sometime. If I have already asked my parents for logging in the computer, then maybe I'll show you something in the next video. So, anyways, here's the inside view on the computer. Right here is the hard drive, hooked up pretty great, which is successfully hooked on Windows Vista, which is basically, I almost decided to install Windows 7 for this, but I decided to state it as Windows Vista, which is the Windows Vista home mode. So yeah, 
here's another wires which is useless wire I wasn't hooked up right now so I can use the other one and you can see a bunch of capacitors chip and everything including there's the socket right here dialed and everything and including you see the green thing is from the motherboard right here so here's the fans from that fan helps to cool the motherboard so it doesn't overheat and here's the other fan for the exhausts so focus right here you can see it's spinning pretty good and here's the power supply which is you, you can see it's a blue LED from this I like how I like how the power supply actually glows but this is the different power supply so of course that's the zoom in technology power supply which is actually a zoom x power well and there's a model number right here ZU on ZU400 W which is a which is actually a parenthesis X1 and you can see how monitor uh, was a little wide for the screen right here as you can see and of course this one glows right here as you can see the blue one with the glow but the one isn't because it worn out so maybe I'll show you what is inside the front. So take that plate off. And here's the inside of a front face right here. There's your uh, LED right here. That it flashes from the hard drive to scan something. And right here you got your SD card and more things including smart media and anything like ms pro duo pro duo and yeah so here's the rw drive from your cd that you can watch movies or you can play some games so yeah So here's the one with the HP Pocket Media Drive Bay, it's just we don't use that right now. Maybe it's just used for ejecting something out. So here's those inputs and outputs, and here's US, three USBs. Going I'll show you something more later. This is where the spot where the RW drive were, and here's the SD card. And expansion bay, which is this is the spot right here under the RW drive. And here's that one right here, media bay. And that bottom right here is from this. So here it is one for the microphone and one for the headphones, and three USBs and the cable from 1394. Which is, we don't use that, basically. So, and I believe that's the connect cellular thing or anything. Whatever. But here's a power button. And here's the LED for this. And here's the back of that. Which is full of a little bit of full of dust. And here it is. Here's the power button right here. Which is actually plastic. So yeah, we'll clip it back on, and we'll see if we can, if you can see the screen saver on this during the lock mode. As I don't want to forget is the one with the spot, it's a power button right here, and the one with the spot with the LED is there from hard drive. So again, the small button is from the power button, and the other right here is from the LED. From the hard drive, of course. I'll let you have a look. Alright, now finally, as you see, 
you see that right here the dark one as you can see the logo right here and then there's the other thing which is right here so yeah there's the logo of Windows Vista and here's the other thing right here which is comment down below what kind of green thing is that it was just coming from the windows actually that green thing right here it's pretty interesting I and mean, I know that logo so everyone knows the logo because that's the uh, OS computer right here so again here's the view here's the view of the computer setup which is a nice really great run which is I never I never didn't show you yet from the setting from HP monitor which is it has a menu actually maybe I was making press that one first there we go or maybe I can go ahead maybe select one I have to press it all the way down so press menu all the way down there we go it has an input selection which is actually has a different one which is we don't have it looked up right now no input signal of course so v VG VGA is actually a computer cable from the monitor oh, I think I did it again whoops <laughs> all right at least we can try again let's check the menu come on come on there we go oh I always want it oh well that's the third time we did it so let's try again let's just not Let's just not keep doing that, okay? Let's go. Here we got the uh, switch video input, brightness, contrast, or contrast, image control, color, quick view, language, management, information, factory reset, and you got your exit right here. And right here is you got your volume settings for your monitor. I mean the monitor volume is I don't I still don't have it hooked up right now I'll use this PA right here as I didn't think about the select button without the setting appears this is very interesting auto adjustment progress so yeah and I wanted to give you the request and since you know, I wanted to let you hear how RW drive, RW drive work. Which is I have the CD, the CD right here. Which is, uh, yeah of course, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Which is, there's going to be another Ryan and Winter's Excellent Adventure coming up soon. Which is I'm still going to fix it, but don't worry. So yeah, I'm going to let you hear how working those thing were so since if we didn't get to push those button or we can reach it down so that we can get the tray closed or if we can push it now all right here we go of course when it closes when the tray is hold that means it won't sh shut the tray down or shut the tray all the way in all right listen to the cd oh nothing okay So yeah, 1988. I mean, this is the working CD, nice and clean and fresh condition. Alright, you 
can see the green LEDs flashing. It's reading the desk. So it takes a little while. Oh, nothing working. Okay. So, we'll do that next time. So, yeah. So, bye. Bill and Ted's excellent invention if you guys watched it before. So, nice and clean, shine, bright condition of the CD. So, yeah. I'm going to put this back in the case. Whoops. <laughs> no, I'll put this back in the moment. So, here we go. All right. That's the Windows Vista right here for the view. So, now it is time for the shutdown. All right. Focus. Right here. There we go. I'm going to put the mouse cursor here, including, there's the settings for reset, sleep, and shutdown. Including you got your SAF access. Make your computer easier to use. Windows will read and scan this list automatically. Press the space bar to select the highlighted option. So yeah, we're not going to use it right now, so we're going to cancel. cancel this. Including we got the settings from the... Caps lock. Well, yeah, we're not going to use one, so. Alright. Let's shut them down and you'll see how shutdown works on my computer. So, so you'll hear how well this thing is going on. So yeah, that is it, including, of course, monitor goes to sleep after the shutdown, because if you try to wake it up, then the monitor still gets on to sleep mode. And here's the sign, monitor going to sleep, sorry about not focusing, so one more time, here's the blue light, that means the monitor is coming on, monitor going to sleep, that means monitor is on a sleep mode so of course it changes color to orange that means the computer is off and or sleeping so yeah that's the overview of the start and shut down on windows vista in 2021 so yeah that's it thanks for watching i'll catch you in another video see ya